Holding on to what I know, to everything I've learned, what is real and fabricated? What is wrong? What is my problem? What can I get out of this world that I created? Fighting the storms in my head, don't know where I have been. I'm alone, no one to turn to, no one understands. Shit's too complicated. Away, and I feel like. of the trip but we still have today the whole day to explore cradle mountain we were thinking we'll do marin's lookout track but let's see i will keep you updated obviously i don't want to keep on living this life so faceless i think you can tell by my voice that i haven't had coffee and i just woke up So here I am at the Cradle Mountain Visitor Center. So everyone has to come here, check in. Uh, we misplaced our holiday pass, but we showed our transaction. So they gave us um, tickets to show in the bus and for the day. And also, there's a little cafe here. So yeah, every uh, breakfast place closes by 10 in the mountain. There's this cafe here, which is open. I'm gonna go and see if there's any food option. So these shuttles over there, the blue ones, they take you, they take you over to the Dove Lake and a few more spots. So we are here, and we go to Ranger Station, Snake Hill, Ronnie Creek, and Dove Lake. So we just got off from the shuttle, um, we were thinking to drive here but good we did not because after the third stop you can't really take your car up here because there are no parkings. Um, also as soon as you get down there is this place and where you go ahead and register your walk. And that is Lake Lilla. We're going up to Overland Track and up to Marin's Lookout. This path is so beautiful and I'm glad that we are doing it in summers. Everything is in full bloom and it's fabulous. Oh my God, more stairs. It is getting steep, so let's see what the route ahead brings us. But oh my god, that view is fabulous! I'm now on overland track, and my watch thinks I'm hand washing. Stupid watch, I'm walking. Can 
that behind me is Crater Lake and it was an okay walk up here um, now the steep section begins which will take uh, take us up there and we can see an expansive view of the lakes three lakes and Cradle Mountain all together <laughs> but look at that that is a beautiful lake and the two lakes are also fabulous and I'm loving this hike so glad I didn't miss it summit but we met some people and they said it's really difficult and really far up let's see and we are almost there I think we deserve a reward now because these pairs from that um, cafe in the visitor center and I'm so glad we did this is my reward to come up here yeah. I think this was one of the best 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 treks I have done in all of Australia this is my number one now it was moderate not that difficult just a few bits and pieces but I think everyone can do it and I'm loving those views I mean look at that that's Cradle Mountain and then that's Dub Lake so much to see around here and the views it's never ending so we spent some good I think one hour here but it's 3.40 now we are descending our way back um, and the views were stunning you have to do it you cannot miss Marion's lookout in Crater Mountain So we are taking this route 
uh, to the way back to Ronnie Creek um, Visitor Center and that's where we are going to catch our shuttle back to uh, the main visitor center of Crazy Mountain. But I try my best to not fall apart And I find it hard to let go The memories keep me together Gotta fight till the end, no pressure, no pressure And I find it hard to say no Who the ones who want something better Who the ones who never say never Pleasure. These are Crater Falls, Creek Falls, something like that. But this way down is beautiful. A complete change of scenery for, from what we were seeing when we were coming up. This is amazing. I mean, look at that waterfall. Oh my god. I got nothing to be scared of. Because where people live, there is always love. Someone left this and a jumper on their way back to the visitor center. Don't do that. Clothes are not biodegradable. So you are basically littering this whole place. It's so pretty and some stupid people like this, they, they just make things bad for the nature as well as for the wildlife here this is so stupid i'm taking it back with me and i'll drop it up to a visitor center like i don't know what they'll do with it but don't leave them around here please take your litter with you And if you see there, there's a warm bed. We are on our way back and there, there are so many warm baths around here. There's one right over there. One behind. But this is so cute. I mean, I'm seeing warm baths for the first time and this is amazing. Would you pass out? Find it 